Hello fellow Blender users and welcome to Blender 3D Animator's 11th Blender 3D tutorial. Today we're going to be going over meta meshes in Blender. Um, let me show you an example of uh, something that I created using uh, meta. So just give me a second to open this. a second and I made this creepy looking guy with buck teeth nostrils strange eyes that I need to delete those off of it's still like stained his eyeballs but anyway I created him in Blender using Natas. So, why don't we get started? Open up a new Blender file. Um, delete your default cube. Space. Add me uh, Meta and add a Meta ball. Now, hit Tab to go into Edit Mode. And um, if you're in Edit Mode, you'll see these red and green lines around it. Um, so space add meta ball. Now the thing with metas is that they they're attracted to each other, so they'll stretch out and kind of combine. Now right here, if you do the wire size down, it'll increase the resolution, and it's not as choppy as you can see. And then nice high resolution, but laggy. So I think I'll keep it at something a little bit higher. So um, it's actually really helpful with uh, creating characters. Um, it's a bit hard to render like uh, animation stuff. It takes time using Metas. Um, it's still worth it. Some people think that it's not. I kind of think it is. So let's start by making. I guess we can make a character. So size up a, a top. Uh, ball and size so it has like an uh, oblong head so we're in front view um uh, a side view and add a meta ball as you can see size it down and go down here um okay it just froze so size it down Go down here and select negative, and drag it over, and go to front view, or this is the front, so now go to front view, and you can see it leaves an indent, so now you can make like, um, eye sockets, so and then you can shift D, duplicate, drag it on the x-axis, make another eye socket, then go back to, uh, side view here, space add, tube, rotate it on the z-axis, 90 degrees, size it down, uh, rotate it, put it in, it's pretty much center, so I have like a nose, you can add a mouth, um, add a, made a tube, Drag it over here, just size it down a bit, go back to your front view, grab it on your y-axis, get it kind of in position, and select negative, and uh, change the size of stuff, uh, grab it on the z-axis, you can make him have like a, like he's, uh, like he's yelling, so we can keep it like he's yelling, pretend he's yelling, so now go back to your side view, space, made a tube, rotate it on the y-axis 90 degrees, and put it there, size it down, kind of like a short little little neck here, and space, add, add another uh, tube, rotate it on the y-axis 90 degrees, and uh, 
Spies on the VX is a bit, um, oh, you can't, well, it's kind of a, get kind of that kind of shape, and then space, add a meta ball, and that'll kind of go down here at the bottom, give it like a, an odd shape, and then you can increase the size and fat, hold on it, froze up again. So give me a second here while it's freezing. Um you can make him skinny fat. Let's go with like a pretty fat. And then um space add made a tube. Drag it down. Rotate it ninety on the Y axis. Um, slide it down, rotate it on the y-axis about 45 degrees, go to front view, and then drag on your y-axis and till it goes inside your guy, and then you have a little arm in your guy. So then you just do the same with your legs, and um, to add eyes, to solid space, add mesh, UV sphere. I smoothed it out, dragged it up to where his eye sockets are, grabbed it on the y-axis until it went to the right spot, sized it down, and just kind of plop it in there. And then shift D, drag on the x-axis back over and you have yourself some eyes and a little cartoon character. So I hope this tutorial, tutorial helped you guys out and I'll be seeing you guys later.